who said you could stop? Shooting this bitch stopping? Get your ass moving. No, I'm right. We have them, them, them things gall. to do. Absolute gall. I didn't tell you that's all. Are in the way. Yeah. I swear if you hurt your feet, you make us too much money with that shit. How ugly do you think this thing is? It's like it's hometown. Do you think it's like one of those, uh, like a little butterface? Uh, you, you think it's like, like weird? I think it looks pretty mutated, right? I fucked their feet. Look at that. Is, you know, that's probably how they fucking got there to begin with this mutation. Mm, fucking. That's true. Sure? Uh, no other explanation for such an absolute disgusting waste of genetics. Look at this absolute freak. You think it could speak common? Uh, I, I never actually asked boss. I swear you are the lowest bearer of genetic mutations, I swear to god. If you could understand us, could you could you do a flip right now? <laughs> I don't think I could anything. I don't think I could understand oh, I guess dumb as bricks. Hold on, the guy, the guy. Oh hell yeah. I'll find I'll find us a place. We might actually be able to make some money here. Hang on. Alright, uh, exceptional. Do you think we could gamble about how many shots it would take to make them cry? Yeah. Excuse me, gentlemen. Uh, I, I noticed that you're not a particular opposite tend to very expensive taste. <laughs> and I was wondering if perhaps you may be inclined to rinse this fine specimen of ours. Excellent at killing, excellent at, you know, hitting, a crying. I left my wallet somewhere, one moment. Ah, damn. Everyone, leave they're coming wallet. back. No, they're coming back. Oh, there's fucking gnomes here? Oh, the, the goal, the goal. No, it's an establishment like this. What is this place? It looks like a food place. We'll head up here. Not used to it. I want you to, can you go kick that? Oh, fuck. God damn it. Never mind. What a waste of time. Hey, you put that fucking thing away. Oh, what? What are you gonna do, show me? I didn't, I didn't say you could fucking stop, like, stop running around like a fucking leg or something. Oh god! Brother, no! The hell are you doing? What the hell are you doing to my brother? Oh! Oh! Do something, you animal! I'm off. Welcome to the end of city. I mean no harm. Oh, God, God. Can I see your wrist? Oh, God, oh, my I mean no harm. No harm. Look, no harm. Friend. Friend. body floating in the water. I'm heading off world, so I'm gonna do one final lap I've always wanted to do. I've just scummed down a fucking fighting call for a Well, shit. <laughs> I'm heading off world, so I thought I'd leave it with a bang. And, uh, also, you don't recreate me. One, right? I don't. I know I don't. I'm just being pleasant. Yeah, I get you. What about uh, underhook? I'm making well, a statement sure. moving. Yes. Yeah. I know. I don't even... I'm being very fucker. I just gone down a fucking culprit. Yeah. Mike cares about who I'm impressing with this guy. Okay. But, uh... Let it be known. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, man. What about do you? Go off. But, uh... I mean, nonetheless, you, 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 you,
well. It's just a bike. I saw nothing. I don't, I don't know what you're on about. I'm heading off load anyway, so. Security. Oh, that's good, dude. Just can't fuck the cops. The, the mushroom is. You can trust me. You seem like you're stunned, I'm struggling. I I'm struggling right now. Really yeah. I can take a look at our color. Can we like. not crop uh, them with noise? Oh, okay. Kind of a weird place to enter a tavern. Okay. Is it okay if I take a look at your color? I'm not gonna do anything that hurts you. No. No. It's only food. Oh no. I'll deal with that. <clears throat> okay. Do you have any way that you can Thank communicate? You. Can you raise your hands if it's okay? Are that is true. Difficult. I'm trying to work out what how there's any means that they can consent, but uh, I mean, I guess maybe we have to get the cutter off before they can move. Sorry, I'm, I'm just gonna give it a try. If, if I'm doing something bad, I'm sorry. Hello. I would like to. I, I'm. I would like to take a look at okay. this lady's collar and see if I can, you know, turn it off. Collar. I. Sorry. Can you say that again? <laughs> okay. Struggling. First off, off the bat, just by looking at it, you can tell it's uh pretty high tech. Okay. Um, much more advanced than you would expect out of a collar. Um, just off looks alone, it is absolutely a shock collar. Um, mm -hmm. it seems a bit embedded in her. Um, if you're trying to get like a schematic or like deck into the color to get like an idea of what it exactly does, um, I'm gonna say that's a pretty high kick DC. You. I will kick you. I will kick you. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm really just trying to like, because she seems like nonverbal and not able to talk. I'm trying to just disengage whatever's going on so that she can, you know, like. Be a bit more free to move. I can't um, do this right now. If there's any kind I'm of like you know, release. Of you um, You're decking uh, I mean, four, right? Decking is a five. Five. Dirty yeah. twenty. I was gonna say the DC was twenty anyway, so congrats. Um. Yeah, no, this is a shock collar that is straight up embedded into her body. It is made for multiple purposes. Obviously, from where you're at, you can't really get a good read of how embedded it is into her body. Uh, but you can imagine Holy some... Fuck this. <laughs> uh, the, uh, affirmative, the slavers the are dead. The slavers to are dead. to do with uh, being embedded into her spine. It's pretty <clears throat> common for a lot of, uh, like, internal slave colors. It seems to have functions in it that are able to shut off certain parts of her natural biology. Or at least that's what you can tell from some of, like, the coding that you can grasp from mm -hmm. it. It seems to have an adrenaline mm. meter on it as well. Can... Is there anything I can do just to like, give her a little bit of freedom? Or is it literally just, I... it's too... You can uh, take her cuffs off. Yeah, okay. I'll, I'll do that. Then. That'd be that'd be like a small little deck. Mm-hmm. I'd say the DC for that's like, I don't know, ten. They're not particularly hard to crack. Mm-hmm. So in that case. <laughs> you're just a failure by one. Um because you're not doing anything crazy. I'm just going to say that that's just gonna take a while. Okay. Okay. She 
these ones usually cups like this like tech cups are usually pretty easy to crack these ones just have a slightly different coating than you're used to mm -hmm. um otherwise her everything else that you can tell off of her from this looks alone cups can be decked into pretty easily since you don't have the key collar you're not sure if you can do anything with it at this point in time Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'll uh, I'll take a bit of time on on this uh, on these cuffs. I guess in a minute. <laughs> Anything uh, more mechanical you need, Alphonse? Uh, well, not unless you can extract a collar from someone's spine. And then beat them up. Uh, <laughs> nope. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. I could also probably make some hot. I think this one's barrel. Uh, let's not use language yeah. like this one, right? I can repair your problem. Okay. What? I think she should be able to talk to them. Well, that's kind of dehumanizing, you know? You think she should be able to talk to them? Shut the fuck up, soft skin. Anyway. It's <laughs> fair. You know what? I'm gonna go hey, and see and there he presses the button, the collar, the, the, uh, shackles, okay, uh, pop off, or at least unlock. That should be at least a little better. You uh able to uh, take care of her? I uh just you know, she seems like she's been through some shit. Sure, I guess. Uh, just make, I'll be back. Just make sure she you know huh? is safe. Okay, whatever, shit. whatever. Okay, thank you. You're not gonna move from that corner. She's not gonna move from that fucking corner. We were able to get the facial apparatus removed. I fucking wouldn't. Anyone got a spoon? I could probably do some. Uh, Cheeto likely does. Yeah, we got. You got a spoon, Cheeto? Okay. Somewhere. You yeah, know, I would uh. How do they respond? Literally anything getting close. You know, you <laughs> so you yeah, no, I would keep. Oh, look at how they respond to literally anything getting close to them. Thank you. Let me just. Here, spoon full of soup. Let them do it. They won't. That remains to be seen. You ain't had the life experiences I had. This pipe is all that keeps me from being like that. I know what it's like to be like that. I'm sure you do. But not everyone is you. Oh, okay, I'm holding it right here. Okay, yeah, okay, I might want to get the juice. Sure, sure. Here's the bowl. You want the bowl? Here's a spoon in and everything. Eat like a person. They're not leaving this fucking corner. That remains to be seen. Give them space. Go on. Don't 
Don't look at them in the eyes. Give them enough space where they won't feel threatened by your presence, Sonia. Try not to stare at them. Mm -hmm. Eye contact. But they look bad. so cool. Glad you think that, but I. I, yeah, eye contact is no good. I'm hungry. Oh. But I can't eat. I'm not allowed to eat. I don't know where I am. This, this is, this is not a dark room. What the fuck happened? No. Good question. No idea. We're all just Great. peacefully enjoying our tavernness. Saw some slavers trying to sell them as a fighter. Oh, oh this, is fuck. this is a fight dog. Shit. Yeah, no, you you ain't. Take, no, as in you, you take that muzzle off, they are going to fucking bite you. Oh, I do that all the time. If you're biting yeah, them, they're too much. Yeah, if they're made for fighting, then... That's... shit like this before, but I ain't never unshitified it, besides me, right? But Regardless, we shouldn't be seeing their previous handlers anytime soon. I well, they not knock did... them off. Well, didn't they get shot? I saw last year. in the nicest way possible. That, that is an animal shaped like a person. 
I do not mean that in a derogatory way. I mean that as, like, literally the way that they function. If you take that much happened to me, why haven't they tried to leave yet? The door is open. They are unbound. Well, they're probably waiting for Taser from uh, the Taskmasters. Well, we gotta figure out something because Benny's gonna come back eventually, and uh, he's gonna freak yeah, out with that. Yeah, we don't want Benny to. Benny's a good man, but he he is he cracks under pressure pretty quick. Indeed. Yeah, no, I think that I think that thing. Would, that person, whatever you want to call it. They will rip Benny's throat out, absolutely. Uh, oh, absolutely, and then if they do that, I'm gonna have to put them down. Let's... refrain. Reasonable. <laughs> refrain. I'm just letting you know the steps that might happen. Well, they seem to... have been used to getting shot, and that looks like a shot collar, so if they do get rowdy... Tasers are available. It's a little draconian, but we aren't going to respond to anything else. Aren't even looking at the food. <laughs> How much military is more to physical stimulation to get them moving? It feels cruel. I'm not saying to. I'm not saying to get them moving. I'm saying to calm them down if they start getting what routing. We can I can see that. Give me the table. What are you going to do with it? I'm going to remove the muzzle. And if they attack me and do not settle down, I will use it to calm them down. But yeah, I have been in this position before. It's not an easy Make one to manage. Sure. Make sure to eat a little bit of food before they eat it. Show that it isn't contaminated in any way. Oh, that's yeah. That is also an option. Hello. Hello. You care about that. I really don't think you do. Okay. Alright, little butter. Uh-huh. I'll just gently remove the muzzle. Okay. Alright. Okay. Alright. We're cool. We're cool. We're... 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 We're relaxed. I ain't looking you in the eyes. Not rather take a bite out of this hearty stew. Oh, Jesus. Okay, alright, let go. Get out of here. Fucking hell. Right? Sorry about this. <laughs> oh Jesus. My God, what, what did I run into? Do you have a. Is it a feral creature? What's going on? Did yes. Oh, man. Muzzle back oh, on. Ah, oh, must do that. Holy oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. shit, that is a fucking bite they have. Oh, uh, yeah, right. There you go. Fuck. Okay. Yeah. Spider. Yes. Uh, Fight spider? Alright. Here's. Combatants. Ah, Here's the taser combatant. back. I see, I see. I'd recommend keeping a grip on this. Seems that they won't oy, oy, oy. do anything just, just if the muzzle's on. If the muzzle comes off, fuck. they're probably cued to fight. Don't get close. What the fuck? I don't. I don't think she'll hurt anybody with the muzzle on, based on what I've seen of things like her. But she'll get unhappy. 
I know. I got mess. I got a bunch of fucking selfie yes, pictures of the damn thing. Uh, the, the what thing? Mushroom took her phone and started mushroom. taking selfies oh, and pictures of it, itself. And it, maybe I can give you some information. Around. Those mushrooms, they aren't mushrooms. I tried to treat one. It turns out they're little uh, non-magical gremlins wearing mushroom hats. They're going around stealing stuff. Uh, what I, have, the fuck I, is I found them in all my books. Well, I found them in my notes. Well, I found them in my notes. Uh, because I have uh, a couple of years ago. They were my you keep it on. They are uh, non magical <laughs> small people squeezed food. That describes it better. Cave dwelling, uh, tiny it, people. It's from a tube, but it's food if, they need, if you need to. On the radar, so right. they They're gonna have to be handled. Put it through the boards. Here's, the here's what I'd recommend oh, keep the muzzle okay. on. And for a bit, so, you're gonna have to be handled a little rough. So it might be good to find them and maybe hurt them, but show you the net they're not gonna do what you want them to do. Here's a squeeze food. Hold still. Open your mouth. I'm trying to good. see if I can use a like GPS like on my there. phone to find Cheetos phone. I don't know if that's gonna... Uh, uh, give me a decking roll, I think? Things like that are zero. usually cute to... Uh, I have zero in decking. <laughs> right? Go I mean, that sounds about right. Wouldn't you guys agree? Crazy. Like, that sounds like a decking thing, yeah? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna try yeah, to do that little we'll fucking down download an app on my phone. That's like if you want my recommendation. Oh, they're gonna have to be acclimated to being around people. Fed, and safe. Uh, like track your kids. They are not gonna be friendly. Starts asking <laughs> you some time. for login information. Number. Login information. The muzzle's gonna have to stay up. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. I'm gonna get through it all. Mm -hmm. It asks you to log in on if your child's phone to confirm. If collar is connected <gasps> to their spine, it's probably Does something it shitty. Credit card information? No, it and needs my fuck fucking child's phone. Uh, <laughs> figure it out yeah, how to get your collar out. Please go find one of those to the box. Oh, yeah, yeah, don't you need to Maybe the only course of action I can figure out is the phone. Phone. getting them to a better system. So then it can Let's go do that. Let's go fucking do that. God damn it. Okay, I'm going this way. Didn't seem like it could be earlier. Before I leave, what? Nah. Seemed like we had a pretty good decker standing here a minute ago. and All they could do was unlock the cuffs. Couldn't get past the collar. That shit's weak. The, 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 like, uh, it's like, okay, that's where they would be. Shit. Come across, so you know, I like, should really nice. don't give a fuck about what they're hurting. Okay, we'll go so take a look. Out of them, yeah. them out. Problem is, that's not gonna be easy. Undead down there if you oh, go down you could be the best fucking doctor in the world. Getting that out of the machine is gonna be fucking tough. No, never, never, never simple. Have you seen All I wanted, got it. Oh, Benny's here. Benny? I'll close up the tavern here. Well, we, can get room. we can't get one person to move. Yeah, yeah, yeah stuff you know, room. Just pick yeah. one. I can just pick one. Okay. I can move them uh, out. They're not gonna please. be happy about it, but I can move them out. All right. Yes. Hey, girlie, I got you. <laughs> I'm picking you up. I'm holding you. <laughs> yeah. Got it. Thank yeah. You. Uh, Edric. <laughs> yeah, see, no problem. No problem. <laughs> Oh, you are so mad. Oh, you're so angry. I know. I know how it feels. Uh, yeah, no, I'm fine. It's it's just it. She's she's not gonna do anything to me as long as that thing's on her face. I always carry a, a, a napkin to wrap it around your hand. Otherwise, uh, yeah, I'm okay. Oh, didn't bite too deep. I want to get a little warm back. That's sharp canines. Fuck, where do I put you? Hey, yo. You seen, uh, you seen Lenny? Uh, no, they are oh. fucking nuts. Do not remove them. Do not remove the muzzle. Hi, Sheep. What are you asking for again? Cassie, Lenny. I haven't seen him. Okay. 
I think tech stuff's easy. Mm -hmm. to, that's it, that's what there's uh, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. oh, no, yeah. Alright. Yeah, this, this, this one needs at least a checkup. What radio are you on? Um, I'm usually on Radio 47. That's me. 47? Yep. Click on that button. Yep. Excuse me, uh, excuse me. Yeah, 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 what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? Five minutes in time. Five minutes. Um, I am a recovering gambler. What the fuck is wrong with your dog? <laughs> no, come on, do your, do your bit. Come on. Uh, uh, bit? I'm, alright, so, I'm a recovering gambler, uh, in need of money. Do you have any spare change? Mm -hmm. you, you do? Do you have any spare change? I don't, for a recovered gambler. Well, what if I... No, recovering isn't... I'm no longer a gambler, so the money will go to a good cause, because I'm just going to go, like, buy more drugs with That's this. what I mean, you should have kept gambling! <laughs> Betty! What the fuck? Have you seen Lenny? Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. I can phone him. Please do. I have the angriest motherfucker in the world right here. Hey, I'd like you to tell me more about this place. I feel like a documentary about the Undercity. That's... that's great, champ. You know I charge for having my life this and things. Yeah, I gotta dip out of a good session, everybody. Don't worry, I'll I'm pulling the face out something. I'll edit in post. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm a little busy right now. So, I mean, you you no response. I, I need to find. I need to find somebody. Hello. Have you seen Hello. that? Hey, found someone. No, I have not. That's so rich. Where the fuck is he? No. Oh wait a minute. He's not on the radio. I'm gonna shit myself. Mm -hmm. The tires are. Where did it go? You turn this into an educational thing. All right. Tell me as much as you do. Magic man. I got it. Basically That's okay. Magic. Uh, help us the Shit, I don't got any okay, words to take Yeah, yeah, this is a, yeah, this is a problem for this. Is this is like a fucking time bomb. Everything alright, Dick? I have this thing. This. This is feral. Do not. Funny. It will get mad at you. It's feral. Good enough. A big gun. Uh, uh, it is <laughs> from to take down. 
Fuck, I don't know. I don't know anywhere good to put them. They got this collar. Well, I need. So, sorry, sorry. I got. We need Lenny because it's got this collar, and that collar is inside. That collar is going into their spine. Then we should go to the clinic. Fuck it. Yeah, I'm not sure if anybody is clinically available right now, but we can get we can check up on that one. Sure, 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 sure. We're gonna open up the cutting edge. Oh. Okay. I mean, I definitely feel alive. I believe in you. I believe. Live. Live. Ah, let's there you go. go. Dude is radio silent on the fucking comms. Try calling up self. Yeah, okay. We we just need some folk to keep an eye on them, really. Cindy! On this radio. That's Cindy. Oh, gun edge is already open. Someone has already opened the cutting edge. I do, yeah. Okay, um... I'm gonna put them in the scary chair. get on my shit over the ethics of this, but I'm going to bind their wrists to the arms. So sorry about this speech. Come on. Come on. Do you understand me? Something is killing me right now. God damn. Yeah, yeah. I need a moment. <laughs> I don't know why the fuck that happened. Also, I have not been able to join the, uh... What's it? I've not been able to join Discord because of... 
the lag. Mm. Sorry. It's fine, it's fine. I'm having so many technical issues. Mm. <laughs> I'm freezing every five seconds. I'm so sorry. Sorry. <sighs> So, what's going okay. on? This person's tied up. They're kind of like, fell or angry or something. I don't know. But they just brought them here. He said that the collar... We want to try and take it off, but... It goes through their body. So we need someone like Len to help. I... I could pair my flesh or even clairvoyance, but... I still want an actual medical profession to help. I see. My sight can help a lot, but I need... I need someone that can actually help them, Dad. I'm not a fucking anesthetist. I can't... I can't do that stuff. I know about it, but I can't do it. What goes through their body? There's something connected to it. Hey. Do you speak common? Do you un understand us? Do you seem to understand us, or...? <laughs> I'm being careful, I'm being careful. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I don't think they understand. Yeah, and... I mean... I don't I know don't if like I can help if I don't know what's magic. going on. If they can't understand, they can't consent. Oh. Hey. Hey. Okay. Situation being explained. All I know is that there's a sea slug in my clinic. They're from a fight pit, right? I don't know. They... They're... Uh, they have a collar, apparently attached to their spine. Don't seem to They're understand. also very angry at everyone. Oh, fuck. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I was so, about to say so that. I would, like to, I would like to invite everybody over here real fast. Come here. Yeah, like, you might... Do you need a mechanic to help with the mechanical part? Like, no, 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 I guess no, no. maybe. So, here's the thing about, they're obviously from a fight ring. Taking off that mask might be really nasty. Come over here. We can't crowd them. If we crowd them, this shit's gonna get real, real yeah, fast. Yeah, yeah. They're, I think they're from a fight ring. That's what I heard over my comm. And if they're from a fight ring, they're probably in a fight instead of flight. Are they bound to the ship? Yes. Victor did it. I've been keeping an eye on it. Okay. Don't call it it. I'm gonna go see what I can do. If they, I'm probably gonna need a medical assistant out of this. Just stay out here. Okay, don't don't surround them. On stand by. Don't I'm surround them. I appreciate. It. Head I'll on need you in a second. Do you want to head out? You can if you want. Yeah. I have okay. less people. Make sure in you here. don't have. This may seem obvious, but make sure you don't have anything that can be used as a weapon on you. I know, I know. If I you can help it. Where did it go? 
<laughs> I've worked extensively with sea slugs, especially the tropics. And I hate the idea, but we've got a taser still. I know, I know. This will make them passive even if it's going Look, off. Cling on me. Them. This is You're somewhere thing. safe. But I'm sure you don't Indeed. believe that. I know. I know. So, from a uh, evaluation, a visual evaluation, is there any dire wounds that will cause death on this person? No. No. Okay. So. Cassie has had extensive experience with sea slugs, especially in his backstory. Is there anything out of the ordinary that he would notice in the first place? Not out of the ordinary. Besides, <laughs> out of the ordinary. <laughs> you know? Mm hmm. Okay. So, he's gonna hold out his hands, put that away, and he's just gonna undo this binding. I'm not a threat. I'm only here to see if you're okay. But no one is over here. May I see your cuts? I know. What's your name? Hmm. Yeah. Ignore them. Um, hmm. May I see your hand? Because I'm not going to touch you without your consent or anything like that. That is if you can understand me in the first place. I can be here all day if need be. But I'm gonna take your hand. If that's not okay with you, make sure to pull away, okay? Okay. have a few wounds and if you do not trust me that is okay so as long as you understand that these bandages are for sea slugs and are meant to bind wounds you can apply them yourself I can show you how or you can just do it by yourself So I'm going to give you some space. Are your legs bound? No. Okay. Mm -mm. You're just going to back off. <sighs> okay. So I can't tell if they don't understand this. I can't tell many of things. I know that they're a little hurt and a little scared. So something that I need from one of you is food. Something good for them to snack on. I made some clean pie. I'm a lollipop. 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 You ever have a sandwich left? Is it like, is it like, does it look like it's been eaten? I don't know. No, I cut it with a knife actually if you want. No, no. Just keep it in a full liquor snack. Enjoy. I'll, I'll buy, I'll buy one. I'll buy one. I can buy you lunch if I want to. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Alright, I'll take that lollipop.
He's going to take this sandwich. He's going to place it right here. And next to it, there's a lollipop. I know. If you are hungry, you're more than welcome. I gave you some space. With the trade of um, uh, sea slug slides, sea slugs are often um, they're often in very bad class, and this one has obviously been traumatized to some degree, and it's a little hard to surmise what exactly is going on here. Excuse me, Roland. You mentioned they were scared, correct? From my understanding, they're not responsive, and they are growling at me. So these animalistic tendencies, I would assume, are behavior of humans. I've worked yeah, extensively with these ones. Environments so. more familiar to them. I, I would agree, experience. but here's the thing, we can't have a mentally unstable individual just running around. I'm not it's saying that we are afraid. Do just to make sure that he will apparently beat as well, so we'll keep in mind. try that, but right now she appears to be resting. She closed her eyes. That means that she's tired. Especially when it comes to animalistic tendencies. Her eyes will usually be plastered on what she perceives as threats, such as Bendy, myself, yourself, uh, Daisy. So, she's either yeah, extremely that. exhausted, uh, I just think that she's extremely exhausted and she's had a very hard day. So we should leave her alone. I would say so, but be leaving her fully unattended might not be the best of ideas. I'm willing to stay here for a while and make sure that they're all right, but I'll probably have to switch out shift. Mm. I, I mean, would like to help if I can. If need be, and I mean, I currently have my own situation to run. Uh, might be able to assist as well. If you specifically Absolutely. might uh, be able to have conversation in bit, uh, Cassie. If you help me with my situation, I'm gladly willing to uh, keep eye on her for now. Make sure that if she does get a little bit too rough, that if someone who is able to be there to assist on that one. I don't want to force her to do anything. That's to be clear. I don't want her to be forced to move. And right now she's comfortable enough to close her eyes and try to calm down. So when she gets her rest, when she sleeps just for a bit, I don't want anybody coughing that long. Nobody. Unless no. I approve it. Mm -hmm. This is my clinic. I make the decisions here. Unless Ruin is here, then, ev then, then she makes the decisions here. But right now, she has her eyes closed. She's resting. That's what we want. Her wounds are not life-threatening. At least from what my estimations. She has food right next to her. I'm assuming you noticed the collar. Yes. yes. I suspect that it's a bomb collar. And I need to get in but sure I mean, it also said that Victor said uh, connected to spine, the muzzle. I think so. I think these are the color of both being so somewhat connected in that way. I Mine think she might be a is to be. I think she might be a glamour slug. One specifically bred for looking pretty and being a slave. It's just, I think she... The individual who sold her to me claimed them to be a, a fighter. A fighter? A Indeed. fighter. She's a fighter, but she's also glamour? 
I mean, look at her, look at her tails, look at her hair, look at I mean, how it sparkles mm. and everything. Mm. Casey, have you ever heard of uh, some of Trident shows, specifically when it comes to showmanship fighting? Some people, mm -hmm. sure, they, may, they wear more specifically costumes in metal, but would not put it behind that some people might make, uh, you know, choose more pretty races for metal. I followed it, you should be able to share it. Maybe the uh, appearance of uh, her own species will be something. That's why this Hopefully. is a good thing to do. Yeah, I'm hoping that will help out. But I'm going to tell you right now, do not cross that line. The threshold is that way. She is comfortable enough to close her eyes and rest, and that's exactly what I want. They have regenerative capabilities, so all the cuts and gashes on her, they're not bleeding anymore, none of it's life threatening. So she is just recovering in her own way. Unfortunately, it's not the most be. interesting response, but it's the right one in my opinion. I mean, interesting does not really matter. It's more for comfort sake, and they seem to be. I mean, when I approach you, sure, I am intimidating individual. When I went close, they started growling quite loudly. So, we understand if she needs to have a her moment. Oh yes, I think that having a few minutes to herself so she can better just. Home down. She's probably been at she's probably been at a hundred for hours now, getting here and getting her some of her thoughts. But as of right now, would you perhaps go figure out a way to maybe relocate her maybe to more comfortable position? Because and if I remember That's correctly, is your op is your operation chair? If somebody comes in here, and clinic might not be available. I mean, we're gonna have to deal with her regardless. Yes, we have two spots right here that I can improvise into surgery spots, but if it's crucial to the level of uh, brain surgery, yes, I'll have to okay. use that. But... Cece, if you'd be so kind. Oh. Holy shit, sorry. I, like, run to the wrong clinic, then I realized which clinic I was supposed to go to, and then I had to run all the way back. Shit, so, so <laughs> Cece. <laughs> So right now, we're dealing with somebody who is extremely traumatized, from my estimations. She, I believe she was in a fight ring, or something along those lines, and it's not good. We were hoping that having another one of that species show up and try to talk her down and try to convince her that she's in a better place would be within their interest as well as possibly yours. If you'd be kind, don't Just let any corpo get this out to you. Yes. I want to put this out to you, if they were in a fighting pit, the enemy could have easily just been of a socks, so ZZ could be seen okay. as the enemy. We could it. But we should, we I should do. try this first, but if she, if she attacks you, she is unbound. She is unbound. Do be careful. We, uh, this big man said himself, claim to be biter. Do be careful. There's a... Uh, Sloan and Alice are outside right now. Oh, uh, uh, Corpus. It's because I, mean, it's, it's cause I mentioned I, I kind of, oh. you know, because I, I was confused. And I'll all chat that about it. Side. Also, I recommend Actually, not having you your weapon. Is it what did you yeah. specifically say, Cece? Or you can give it to Cassie. I mentioned the Cecil, but that's about it. So it's oh, shit. I might be able to, I have an idea. Know. I might be able to draw Alice away at bare minimum if you want to deal with one. Be so kind. If we get a also, corporal report I'm on just this, gonna put my shield I just want to be careful. Yeah. I can get Alice away temporarily. I'm not sure about Sloan. I'll hire you if necessary. So how are they looking? So they yeah. were bound to the chair. I thought that would probably that would be not a great Yes, I don't think that's great. I know. I wanna this elaborate is to her that this is a safe space. Confusing for and you. And unbinding her, giving Stressful. her food, and giving her space is all things that I would consider calming factors. Additionally, she has been given a sandwich if necessary, but something tells me that she's been fed not gonna her entire life, and she doesn't understand that this is actually food. So that's I okay. I didn't understand want the food in the shop. shop when I was first around. Exactly. Uh, yeah. Bendy, could you, you could you go make a porridge I was for like a you. stew that just looks absolutely horrendous? Just look I, at uh, slime, but tastes good. 
I was oh, the hell you gonna when she had a muzzle on? God damn it, stupid. No, I was more important. There's yeah. also other things. The way rations are fed to some people in prison. It's not always presented in a form. I'm not gonna push I you. I'm not gonna push you. Or this utensils. is all very confusing for you. When I first got to the game, there's a few individuals I need to get a I wanna really let good you know though you were not on alone. that because uh, one we need to calm her down pacify her so she isn't biting and trying to kill people oh, 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 oh. Uh, uh, and number two hey could you like not talk about this outside because all I can hear is you guys talking please I need to stay in here just in case, but is that I'm better? Just, just I'm all leaving for a little bit. Let us talk quietly. Sorry, I've been put through all of this. No sleaze folk should be dealing with this. We're alone now. I'm not gonna hurt you. Do you mind if I sit down? <sighs> You've had to fight other sea slugs, didn't you? Is that why you're so... Well, not even that why. Whoever your old owner is, they will no longer hurt you. I will make sure of it. Because I know what it's like to be in the position that you were in. I may have not been in fights, but I knew what it was like to be a slave. My old owner, exotic, a horrible individual. And somebody who I never somebody who I am glad I killed. The people who were out there <laughs> using the wrong arm. I'm so used to having an arm. It's a bit difficult now. The people who were out there, they're good people. They helped. They helped me get out of my predicament.
question for you. Do you want the mask off? I can take it off for you if you want. I want to make sure you're comfortable. I understand it's going to take time for you to adjust and to overcome some of the hurdles that you've gone through, but you aren't in danger anymore. In the Undercity, we look after each other. Sea slug, human, demi-human. We look after each other. I'm not going to force you to make a choice. It's your choice. You don't have to be forced to make any more choices. You don't have to be forced to fight anymore. You are free to do whatever you want. It sounds like a weird word I know. Free. It's scary at first. You're unsure what to do. You feel like you should just run back, go back and be there. I had somebody who took me in when I was young. Taught me to be a... Well, the sea slug I am today and hopefully I can do the same to others and help them The people who were out here, though, they wanted to help you. They want to ensure that you're safe and well. That collar on your neck. To get it off you if you wanted it off. I've never been good at doing my talks, but, you know. We're here together. Mind you, but of your previous work. Helpless, lifeless eyes. No will to fight back. Will you allow my friends to help you? I really need therapy. To take off the collar.
if you don't want them to help you. Would you at least let me? If you want the help, is it okay to come in? If you want the help, you have to give us a sign at least. If you want to be able to be free, to be able to make your own choices in life, to make those that made you suffer pay. Give us a signal, and we'll make sure it happens. They only want to help. They aren't going to give you any harm. Is that alright? my friend Cassie come over so we can inspect the collar I'll ask him to come over slowly alright Cassie Cassie! Come over slowly. Slowly. I'll be here, okay? So... You tell us. Whenever you're comfortable. Oh, uncomfortable, sorry. To the degree that they've been, um, he's gonna show. He's gonna give you like a little bottle that has a big old straw that can be fed from upside down or upright, something to get through her muzzle. We can't remove the muzzle, and from what has been described to me by Victor, um, the likelihood of her being more animalistic than she is human is very, very likely. Any progress here? The muzzle appears to send her into a rage whenever it is removed. Not only that, but I have a, 
a uh, Decker here to see if the drugs that might exist that are being in, that are being input into her system uh, through the caller. Uh, I'm trying to see if that technician is capable of um, disabling that, so we can probably have a more. What do you want to do with this case? What is this for? I want to see if she recognizes it. See if she knows how to use it, or maybe there's a response, an instinct that she can employ. I don't know. So pull it out to her and see if it will work. If she'll take it. I have a question. Do you recognize this? This bottle here. Okay, that's fine. Um, Her eyes are fixed on me. I'm gonna back off. Yes. I don't think she trusts me. Go. On. Can you access that thing from here? Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. Do you recognize this? I don't know what this vial does. Cassie believes it was something you might understand a little bit. Okay. I don't know if you want to have a look at it. I'm so sorry that they did yeah, this there are There are a couple of... It is basically a I'm cocktail so sorry. of drugs, based on what you were able to Hello! Play. Any available NPCs who aren't earlier. playing a um, character or aren't is, currently is locked into a conversation? Do you mind coming back to the spawn room? Collar runs on. In just a minute, I'll be there. Uh, Alright! Very proprietary and very strange. This is... Much like the construction itself, back alley shit. Uh, this is this is this is the fucking equivalent of like a, a, a fucking USB disc that bricks a computer that is entirely in Russian. And give you it's some space. Difficult to glean exactly what goes where and what does what. All you're able to generally I can leave is and give you some space so you can of the color itself. become more. Uh, Acclimated to this place. Um, We're not here to hurt you. We're here to help you. And seems to have been there for a very, very, very long time, uh, pumping a continuous back and forth of stimulants and relaxants into her body at specific times, um, as well as being wired to electrocute her with her adrenaline. Heavily. Um, it's, it's a nasty sound. I'll give you time. All right. Gotcha. I'll be back soon. What is the current? What is the current update on things? Did okay. someone cause any trouble? I pulled away as much as I could. Uh, you would need. Uh, you could conceivably. If you need anything, now. If you had the understanding of. I am here for you. Individual. I will be here. Place and set this All right. Uh, this is unfortunately. I'm going to very. Be... I will be over there though. I'm going to okay. stay okay. here. If anything does happen, if they get uh, jumped, has the if they say anything, of you just yell at me, Cassie. I'll get him and him up down. All over. Um, which means that in some ways, it's difficult to really glean what you need to tap into to do anything positive. At least right now. I don't understand. Freedom. Help. What does that mean? What? What? 
does these words mean? Discussions about fingerprints like this uh, in similar places uh, or familiar places uh, with similar situations. People wanting to help out captured uh, sea slugs and other creatures, primarily sea slugs, uh, with their shock collars. Um, problem is, is that most of these. Uh, threads on the form are those threads. Those threads that are the original post and then a bunch of other people going bump and anyone heard anything new about this with absolutely nothing of use. It's still on us. I'd suggest give her some time as well. There is a general assumption among the threads that you have seen that the person that did this is an independent, con technically an independent contractor that works exclusively with uh, fighting weapons. Um, there is no name attached to it, but they seem to be relatively consistently coming up either as a real figure or a somewhat mythical one. But either way, there is a general belief that this is a single individual that uh, people that own slaves for the sake of, for the exclusive sake of fighting uh, will go to set up these situations. That's a much of music. Hmm? God, if I could get more comfortable, but I don't want to move. I can't feel my hand! <gasps> Pain and misery! <sighs> oh, oh boy. Oh my throat. Being a ye uh, fucking grumbling feral animal fucking hurts. Beast of Ebers.
entrance to the lichen. Just tell me. guys from up top down here right now, right outside this door, they're fucking messy. I'd recommend keeping any problems. I hope I am not in. Oh, I cannot see the chair, so I don't know. Okay, I'm not. Okay. It's just like in a chair. Boo -boo -boo -boo. You be stuck in a chair. You peach in a chair, god damn. So the guild is going to pass. Okay, so they're still running on speculation. I feel like saying that it's going to pass is a little bit dangerous, specifically also with how many uh, semi human are waiting in Undercity. So, 
still stupid choice, but who are these individuals? Anybody that we know or more frequently or are just strangers that decide to pop in and be dicks? No one can hear me but you. I hate it so much, I hate it so much, I hate it so much. In end, I am Guardsman, so... I'm Let's get to the corner, but right now she's too fight or flight right now. She don't do don't ever wanna move. It's spook scared. Shook like a boo. attack you or anything like that, but you are about to growl at me in three, two, one. Well said. Okay. <clears throat> so he has three bottles. Uh, one has an aroma of stew. One has the aroma of kind of fishiness. Uh, another has an aroma of just general slop. Uh, all of which uh, smell pretty good to that of the, uh, the regular nose. Um, however, they have like a little... Uh, little straw uh, that is basically meant to be squeezed and well that's what you're looking at so he's going to hold it upside down it's not going to be coming out just yet and he's going to kind of hold it out and looking for a response I wish I knew a lot of things about you. But I'm working with what I got. This is her regeneration factor uh, taking place? Is it like healing up the little gashes and wounds that were. Yeah. Okay, good. Hmm. Should have thought. Hmm. Hey, Jake? Jake? Huh? Hey. Okay. Animalistic tendencies. How do I pacify an animal? Usually that's with food. Uh, okay. I know you're going to hate me for this. But you're probably very hungry. He's going to hold the bottle upside down once again. And he's going to squeeze it all the way to the end, so it's kind of dripping. He's going to put it upright. He's going to unscrew it. 
going to take it off so it's a less, it's a smaller object. And he's going to try to very gingerly, I know, I know. He's just going to try to, like, from here it would be reaching the plot, it would be reaching the muzzle. So he's, I know, I know. And he's going to gently, very gently and very slowly press it through the muzzle. And he's going to make sure that a little bit of this liquid, this little bit of stew, is on her lips and can like is can easily be. He's gonna quickly just back up a little bit. He's gonna put it back on, and he's going to flip it back upside down. And he's gonna approach again, but he's looking for a response, a different response this time. I know. But this is food. And you'll probably starve half to death. So, from here, he's going to very carefully, right through the nozzle, and he's going to place it right before her lips. Is she giving off any more anger, attitude, anything like that? A little bit, but not much. She's not growling, but she looks like she want to bite. He wants to bite, but I'm over here and there's a straw. <laughs> anyway, and he's going to place it up against her lips and he's going to press just a tiny bit. Okay. And he's just going to try to, he's going to touch her, her forearm real quick. And he's going to try to lift her arm. And he's going to take her hand and he's going to place it around the bottom. So she's holding it. And he's gonna back away. He makes a little squeezing gesture. It's food. Is she is she doing it? Is she eating? No, she don't really understand. Okay. He's gonna very gently take her hand and he's gonna <laughs> squeeze the bottle. Ooh. Just try to squish the bottle again. And he's gonna try to get hit her hand. Gonna press his finger against her hand so it's her hand that's also squeezing the bottle. I'm trying to get her to learn that if she squeezes the bottle, the food comes out. There we go. Okay, see? There we go. And it's a fine it's a it's a fishy stew but it's not uh, it's not like really really bad or anything like that it's actually a really pleasant it's just a very pleasant taste it's a stew prepared by bendy <laughs> now if you like another <clears throat> he holds up two more with the same straws and he's gonna place them on a table uh, push on over. He's gonna place him right here, right in her sight, on a chance that she is hungry once again. Is she going through the entire bottle? Yeah, we go through pretty fast. She was hungry. Is it? The, is it the entire thing? Yep. Okay. He's gonna very gingerly. Take hold of the front of the bottle and the back of the bottle. I know, I know. He's gonna try to take it away. He's holding on to it. Okay. Yes, Roland. You mind to step outside? I assume you have this handled. I do. I'm making progress. She's eating. Oh, yeah. Yep. I'll call you if I need anything. <sighs> I'm rocking 13 right now. And he's gonna take this. <clears throat> he's gonna take the bottle. This one's probably a hearty, like, 
beef stew or something like that. He's going to flip it upside down. He's going to go through the same process, through the grate, and he's going to very gingerly just try to put up, take the bottle because this one's empty. You're not getting anything from it, right? Mm-hmm. It's empty. Yeah. So he's going to try to take her hand once again, Take, put it on this bottle, and he's going to take the empty bottle away. He's going to shake it, make sure she knows that there's nothing in it. He's going to put it down. <clears throat> you know, I know you can't really understand me or anything like that. But I used to work with people like you all of the time. Not to the point of animalistic tendencies or anything like that, but... Sea slugs. Slaves. And you learn a thing or two. They're very intelligent, and as long as you show them the gesture or show them that you mean no harm or anything like that, usually they pick up very fast. But I don't think you can understand me, so what's the point of this conversation at all? Has she gone through the entire bottle already? Yep. No way. He's going to do the same process, flip it upside down, right through the muzzle. He's going to take the bottle very, very gingerly. And he's going to put her hand on this bottle. And he's going to put it away. <sighs> From your markings and appearance, I would think that you were a glamour slug. The ones that are slaves or those trident aficionados and whatever. But I've been told that you're a fighter. Rawr! The scary ones. <laughs> Rawr. Yeah, that. Hey, I'm not bad. I'm not a bad guy. It's just a hypothetical. You know what hypothetical means, right? Of course you do. <sighs> How do I get you to elaborate to me that you want more? Okay. He's going to take the bottle. He's letting it go. And that's all. However, what I do have is this lollipop. It can get through your muzzle. He's going to very gently off of uh, People are going down into the necropolis to, to, to look for you. Uh... You want to be dead? Go on, you want like, to take one alive? of his fingers and hook it Whatever around her want. wrist. And he's gonna <laughs> turn it up, turn it around. And between her thumb uh, and her index, he's gonna place the lollipop. <laughs> and he's gonna make the yeah, gesture of <laughs> like towards the mouth. Yes. Okay. Ah. I've got a muzzle of my own. He's gonna kind of take. That press, you can push it towards your mouth. Like the straw. He's gonna grab the straw, unscrew it. He's gonna like hold it up like he would to give it to her and everything like that. You see this? Just like that. Hmm. Okay, you get a freebie this time. He's gonna very gingerly take the lollipop. Oh, okay. He's gonna. T I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Could take some gauze, stuff it in there. Make sure that the lollipop can. Uh, it will stay in the straw. And he's gonna angle it once again, angle it through the mask, and he's just gonna place the lollipop against her lips, and he's gonna immediately just back off. So it's basically the stem, the uh, the stick is hanging through the the muzzle. It's just. See. No? Is it in her mouth? No, it's just there. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, hard food. I'm going to very, very slowly. <laughs> Fuck. You don't understand that. <sighs> Gonna take this. Fuck. <laughs> I know, I know, 
I know, I know, I know. However, I'm just going to pluck the lollipop very slowly. I know, I know. You probably don't have any concept of hard food yet. You gotta throw it away. What am I going to do? Because you're, you're human. You're... Ah, this feels unnatural. Because you're a human. You're humanoid. You're a sea slug with high intelligence and capability. But here's the thing. I can't give that to you, nor do you think... Nor do I think that you have it right now as of yet. So, transporting you or doing anything with you is going to be considerably difficult. But, you don't know that, so you can't help me. Uh. The hell am I going to do with you? Victor offered to take you in. But I have a nice little house of my own that I think you would appreciate. But there's guns in the house, and I'm kind of scared of you having guns. Uh. <laughs> guns? You're good at conversation, by the way. He's going to take... He's just going to take her hand, place it in his... I am not hostile. I'm not a bad guy. He's just going to gently squeeze. I'm not nothing. I'm not a threat. And I want to express that to you by showing to you that even though I am in contact with you, I'm not trying to hurt you. Here, I think this would help as well. First time you see my face. Aren't I pretty? No? Cool. But either way, he's gonna take your hand again, he's gonna hold it. I'm not a threat. Okay? Not a threat. <sighs> what am I going to do with you? I can't just leave you here alone. Hmm. It'll allow. I want to see if the theory behind you having your muzzle removed and you attacking is correct. The taser's all the way over there, but I don't agree with the taser. So he's just going to. First, lovely. Is she still reacting poorly? No, yep. yeah, she's reacting poorly. Okay, never mind. Fuck! What the fuck am I gonna do with you? God damn it! <laughs> Uh, hold on, just stay right there. He's gonna slide this little stool over. Hi. Okay. So, were you hooked up to any IVs or anything like that when you were here? Nope. He's got slept in the chair and then tied to the chair. Yeah, that's that's mean. <laughs> <laughs> um. All right. So if. You have a bunch of drugs in you right now. I could possibly counteract it. But the thing is about that is that if I do that, probably gonna get really tired. Because it basically turns all the chemicals that is being put into you right now into something a little bit more calm, something a little bit better. Basically, when somebody's heart rate's through the roof at like 190, this chemical would be introduced and basically turn every drug that's a fear response or an adrenaline response or anything like that into just a flat response. Like a, like your brain responding to a sickness. But the thing is about that is that there's going to be a little bit pinch and I've already built up enough trust for you, for you to let me handle your hands. Now, do I want to get rid of that? He's going to slide over needle this little drug there we go hello 
and he's going to take a few cc's worth. He's going to hold up the needle. He's going to look for a response. Okay. going to hold it in his hand. Okay. He's going to gently take her hand. So, first off, out of character, do you consent? Because this could be a very, very big part of your character with the chemicals and everything like that, and this would only do temporary relief. Mm. Are you cool with this being a very short thing? Yeah. Okay. He's going to basically... It's a... Uh, it's something that... It's basically the drug in your brain that it produces to, like, slow you down when you are... Like, when the adrenaline starts wearing off, and, like, it basically puts lactic acid, so you're going to be a little bit sore... Um, but he's going to very gingerly, with the thinnest needle he possibly can, just inject it. It's a small, small pinch, but he's rubbing it, he's making sure that it's not bad. And he's going to quickly take it away. He's going to rub the area, put a cotton ball up against it, and it's barely even painful. And your regeneration capability should take care of that little hole, but leave that on there. He's going to hold out her hand. Whamp. Go right there. See, keep it right there. He's gonna hold the hold the little cotton ball right there. There we go. And around now, you should be fine. So when it com comes to that collar constantly putting you uh, in with drugs, um, I would say like at least ten minutes or so of no adrenaline, no nothing, just a calmness. All right. And that can take effect whenever you would like. Mm, yeah. Feeling better? I don't know if this is taking effect. Usually your systems do take effect, but you haven't really changed your facial features at all. She's been... Oh, how long have you been there? Much. A little bit. Not... The whole time. Oh. Well, either way. I've uh, injected her with uh, basically, if I were to put it simply, calming. Uh, and, uh, the drug- Oh, she just closed her eyes in front of me. That's trust. Mm -hmm. Uh, but I down? injected- Oh, by all means. Uh, here's the- Another stool. What? Slide. There you go. Thank you. She's been responding well. I've got- He holds up the three squeeze bottles of food. Uh, all three of them. All gone. So she's fed. So she ain't starving or anything right. like that. Yeah. I love it. And did, did did you like them? I, she just drank them all, and none of them that she appreciated more than the other. Okay, well, I'll let Bendy know to make some more then. Yeah, I'd probably be wise. Um, she's closing. Oh, she's fucking exhausted. I wonder when the last time well, she yeah. slept is. When you're in a, when you're in those sorts of situations, your body's in constant adrenaline mode. Your body always thinks that you're in danger no matter what, and most likely the cases you are. Yeah, and when it comes to her collar, constantly put like filling her with fucking drugs, that's exacerbated tenfold. <sighs> right now, that would it probably be the best time to, to move this. her. Say what? It just angers me seeing this. Genuinely. Yeah. I used to work with slugs what on her. Yeah. Um, I was thinking... Best if time to move her. Best time to move her is probably now. I'm taking this... Uh, to where? I was thinking my house. It's large. It's spacious. It's not like a cell or anything like that. Plus, Are it has that little... Are you referring to my house? Oh, well, it's our house. How about that, Kami? Okay. All right. Our house. Yeah, our house in the middle of the street. Uh, you know that, like, little, uh... <laughs> I was thinking the same thing! You know that little, uh, you really chair know that we... You really know how to kill the mood. 
house. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know, this is how I deal with traumatic situations. You know, I watched somebody mm -hmm. die in front of me, and I sang, like, fucking the beginning of, like, the Spongebob theme. It was fucked up. <laughs> like, you know how many people I have seen die in front of me? Like, I'm traumatized. I need therapy, motherfucker. Anyway. Oh, you're awake! Holy shit! Fuck! Anyway. Um, Cassie, sorry, calm was, the fuck was, down. Uh, I'm... I don't know. But either way, you know that seat that we have that's kind of in the pit that has a little bit of moisture that builds up? My bed. <laughs> yeah, I think... <laughs> you sleep there? <laughs> yes, that's my bed. <laughs> we need to discuss fine, where though. things are. Yeah, I think she That's my she fucking would... room. I shut the... I build shit in there all the time. That's where I keep my gear. Anyway, you build uh... shit in my room? Same. Yes, I put shit in your room, but... This is not the fucking great roommates. right now. All oh, these roommates. Okay. So. Does she have a name? I have a name too. Uh, I don't think she has a name at all. And I don't think anybody's referred to her with a name. Uh, we could have the. Uh, we could name her, but I feel like. That is for her to choose. It's true. Do not and... pick the name for her. Yeah. That goes for everybody. She will pick her own name. Yeah, I think that's reasonable. But I'm gonna double dose her with this and see if we can uh, see if we can uh, get her from point A to point B without any issue. What do you I think? I don't want to double. No. You because think right now is the best? More distrustful. She'll become more distrustful for us if we keep drugging her. We're it's not, true. We are no better than well, them. These are these are drugs that counteract the drugs that are already in her system. It doesn't That's matter. Thing. To her, <sighs> to her, that is the same thing that is being pumped into her. It does not matter. It's true. Well, we have roughly really breaking the trust that we have tried. Six and five, six between six and five minutes to get her from point A to point B. However, okay. I, I haven't There's even tried moving time. her in her. I haven't even tried moving her yet. So she might okay. resp respond super violently. She might be calm, but she's still animalistic. Well, <sighs> he's gonna take her hand. Hello. Pop up. Stupid. He's gonna take it into the other hand. Excuse me. Okay. And he's going to slowly reach okay. towards her shoulder. I know. I know. I know. <laughs> and he's gonna very to gently. We're here to help. I I do not think that she understands English. I mean, could try and talk to the ceased look at him. Do we? Do we have? Do we have a language? I think you do have a language, and he's gonna very gently push you up a little bit. There we go. And he's gonna switch hands. There we go. Come, come, come. We have somebody somewhere a lot better for you. She is tall. Oh my god, she is tall. Oh, that's chunky. Is your leg hurt? Is her leg hurt? No, I've been sitting down for a long fucking time. What do you want from me? <laughs> okay, uh, I'll, I'll give you some time to recalibrate. Yeah, thank you. So he's going to he's gonna give you some hey. space immediately. Cassie, Cassie, that, Cassie. That's chunky. That's Go chunky. Go deal with that. Go deal know. with that. I don't know. I don't... Chunky, this is a bad time. He's going to spin you around and push you through. Hey. Hey. It's okay, alright? It's okay. Oh, that was not meant to go there. It's okay, alright? I'm with you. I will protect you. As will I. Hey. Come on. Can we make a detour? A detour? Of what kind? A small one. Up the, uh, the ledge. You know where the see the sky? Not for long. The sun will bake you too. <laughs> I know. Come on, let's go. 
You want to grab your guns on the way out? Oh, you already got your guns. Never mind. I've already got them. They're already latched on. I've I've secured them, so it's okay. 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 There we go. She is tall. She's really tall. Mm. Come on. Come on. If you want to get adjusted real quick, then don't worry. We'll let you uh, adjust to the to the sun real quick. Mm -hmm. Just gonna let go of her hand. Take a look. Sun feels good for a Welcome. while, but I might get sunburned. Yeah, we'll get a little uh, dry. <laughs> I think she's really enjoying it. It's nice. Yeah. Trust me. I know the feeling of when. I had the same sort of reaction. Mm -hmm. I've never been held in a cage oh. for so long and can't relate. Elaine, I know. It's beautiful, ain't it? I have some uh, extra clothes at my place. Maybe we should get her. We could get her in like a some better Our clothes. Place. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I keep on saying my doing place. We're this shit again. I'm sorry. I, whatever, whatever. We don't need to argue in front of her. But we, if you have some extra clothes, I've got, I've got a baggy hoodie and some I have some extra baggy clothes. pants. Yeah. It's whatever ah. she's comfortable with, though. Of course. Come on. Come on. This way. We can show you a little bit of the Undercity, too. It is true. I think she'd appreciate the Steam District. I think she... Mm, maybe the Water Maybe the Water District. district. Yeah. Maybe the Water District. Do you think she would appreciate a swim? Yeah. I'm counting on you to keep track of her, though. <laughs> yeah, because I'll be able to keep up with her, so... Huh. I the have long way? some experience. Oh, wait, long way? This is the short way. Why? Are we taking a detail okay. to the water district? Yeah, we're taking the water I want to at least show the water district. Okay, yeah, let's go to the water I didn't district. know what we were doing. You... Okay, you were. Alright, how about you leave? So... How about you leave? <laughs> okay. I wonder when's I wonder what's the last time she's actually had a body of water to swim in instead of being misted. Probably a long time. I can show you a little uh I like to call it the little uh, entrance only certain folk can get into because they aren't water breathers, so <laughs> sucks for them. In this area you would feel a bunch of steam. It's just generally pleasant on the skin when it comes to sea slugs. This here is the water district. Large bodies of water that we can swim around in. Mm-hmm. And TC, at this point I'll let mm. you take the lead. Hold on to my guns then. Gotcha. Wanna go in? You do realize there's a chance that this shock color will start acting up, right? Hmm? It was what, sorry? The shock color. It'll probably start acting up because it gets in the water. Oh, shit. 
Oh, wait, it's not waterproof. They did, they didn't put a waterproof. No, because they're just oh, misting no. her. They're not putting her in actual water. <laughs> I have an idea. Okay. We're not taking it. Up. Basically, what we're, I'm gonna do is just so I can at least coordinate it. Is that we're not going above mm -hmm. the neck, but at least like to chest, so she can at least experience the water. Yeah. I'm small, so. <laughs> I'm, I'm tiny. I'm too good. <laughs> okay. Go. There we go. Ooh, okay. There we go. There we go. What's that? There? there we go. Oh. Nice and cool. This is for everybody to swim in. No one's good. <laughs> Shut up, you're really not helping here, Cassie. Having a hard time treading water, huh, CC? I will dunk you in here. Do not test me. I, I have guns on me. I'm just saying. Okay, good luck. You're free. You don't have to worry about the next oh, time you get water. don't have to worry about it anymore. Okay? There's many places to explore here. It'll take time, but... It'll be a new adventure. Once we deal with this, the first thing we'll do, we'll do a proper swim. I'll show you the secrets that live under the water. The little alcoves that you can go into. You just feel like you need to be alone. Does that sound good? Now, do you want to see some of the uh, other locations? Come on. In the necropolis, isn't it? Getting, getting, getting excited. There, so the big, big, big man is, is out getting rid of the mouse. I'm going to have to just watch the rope for now. But yes, if you can try to get people there, it'd be awesome. CC, medical emergency. <laughs> uh, I'm needed in, I need to turn Fuck, I'm needing to in the Acropolis. Well, give me my stuff back then. I gotcha, I gotcha. Okay. There we well. go. Stop in the moment, probably. There we go. Okay. Okay. So I'm back and find and you, okay? Yes. Okay. Both since the end. Okay, got it. Take her back to our place. Yeah. Shut up. Don't worry. Okay, I'm with you. Us sea slugs, we stick together. Oh my god. 
Okay then. <laughs> Cassie's good. He's a nice person. A good friend. Come on. Let's go to... Hmm. I'm trying to think of the best place. We'll go down this way. Come on. Have you seen vegetation, nature, we'll make a small detour again. This is a place that is near and dear to everybody here, called the Grove. That over there is the fire district. It's quite warm. As you can feel on your skin already, I'm sure. We don't often go there. It's a bit too warm for our tastes. If you feel unsure about anything, or you feel scared, or you don't trust something, just squeeze my hand a little bit, alright? Like it, here, yeah, an example, okay? He's gonna just slightly just hold your hand a little tighter, like that. If you don't like something, just squeeze, okay? Take you to the grove. Let you see that. And over here is, well, the Knowledge District. This is where many people live. Over there is the Grove. You might like it. This is a nice location to if you feel overwhelmed, or you feel like you just need 
a moment of rest. You can come here. So many colors. And there's water over there as well, by a waterfall just around the corner. It's nice being here. Sometimes you can be here to clear your thoughts. It helps. Should we go down this way? And then I'll bring you back that way. Our house is down there. But I thought you might want to see the waterfall. Oh. It's the waterfall. The grove mother here. She tends to it. We look after it as grove tenders. She doesn't mind people like us to jump into the water when we need to. Of course, with the collar on right now, I don't want to risk getting you hurt again. Over there is the farm where they make fresh fruit and vegetables. Understand those words. Should we go to the house? Get some clothes. Come on. Take it to the house. Come on. It's a little steep down here, so I apologise. This is one of the quietest districts you can be in. No one ever comes here to interrupt. This is where the mushrooms all grow. We can get a better view if we go up there. If you want to join me. Do you know how to use a ladder? Come on, I'll teach you. Go let go of your hand for a moment. So, see these? These are steps. One hand. When you want to move up, use the other hand. And you put your foot up on the other step. And yeah. Same process. Would you like me to show you first? Or would you like to have a try? Your hand, actually. This might be a good idea. I'm gonna guide it over to that thing. There you go, yeah. And then you put one of your foot up on a closer step. One of these here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then you start climbing up. 
Let me tell folks. Yep, that's what you do. Okay, there you go. Nice job. That's really good. This is our home. This house over here. Come on, I'll show you where you go to sleep. Go on in. Quite the spacious house. Rather colourful, isn't it? So over there is where Cassie sleeps. That's his room over there. And over here is where I normally sleep, but you'll be staying here instead. Okay? It's dark. It's quiet. Do you want to have a sit down and test it out for yourself? It's comfortable, I assume. <laughs> now. Let me get you some clothes, and I'll put them on the side for you. Nice. Soft. Oh, I'm gonna drop down for a moment. Right, there we go. Here's your clothes. These are yours, okay? You can put them on whenever you want. I'm not going to force you, but they are there for you, okay? If you want to change, I'll go stand in the other room, okay? Do you know how to change? Changing from like one top to another top. Well, this is a problem because I only have other, one other outfit and I was just for goofy silly. I can't go around with that on. <laughs> My virgin killer. No! Just can't stop for a second. Just don't mind any of the, the fright in that thing here. Hey.
just going to flip the page and it's going to be a drawing of you. A simple drawing, but it's of you. You've got the shirt on that you've got on right now. And then it's another, on the next page it's another photo of you again, another drawing. But it's basically teaching you, basically she's drawn how to change your top, essentially, by yourself. Do you want me to leave the book here for you and then you can read it at your own pace? There you go. Can't tell. <laughs> it's then spirit. Can't tell. <laughs> the fuck's sake. <laughs> God damn it, okay. Uh, uh, can you, I'll just hold it and I'll just look away. Oh, okay. Uh, Fish no, no, that's perfect. Okay. Fish <laughs> Okay. So I don't have funny enough, I only have one other outfit. But that's the that's a virgin killer. Mm. I probably shouldn't wear that. <laughs> <laughs> we will just say then the for the for the sake of it, we will just say that you've changed outfit. Oh, Sissy! Right. Hi Glitch! Oh, fuck it out! You oh get a God. pink Oh I'm sorry. <laughs> Damn it, Glitch! She was monster. just about to see fish teddies! Sorry for cock blocking you. Anyway, the phone, which I assume was right here, right beside you on this rock, it starts buzzing. You get a ping from Boston. He says, I heard what happened. If you want, we can meet up in the mushroom district. Talk about it. Fuck it. Shaw already in there at my house. Okay. <laughs> That's all I can really imagine. <laughs> <laughs> I will be your continuous messenger. Also, sorry for spooking you. Thank you. That's, that, I'm not gonna lie, that I, I shit myself when I heard you then. Like, <laughs> heart actually dropped out my ass in a whole time. Anyway. Right, please, 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 she just kind of puts it on her head. Hey, Bendy, just let you know, uh, they loved the food that you gave them. Uh, we're currently at, uh, Ryan and Cassie's house right now. Is it too small for you? It might be too small for you. I'll hey. bet I'll get I'll get you some new clothes. Okay? Hello. Hi. Oh hey Boston. Hey there. This is Boston, this is my friend. Nice to meet you. What's your name? They don't have a name. Oh, Jesus. Uh. They don't have a name. They... I'm just teaching them how to do some stuff. So, 
I'm not a good uh, teacher, to be honest with you, so I'm just teaching the stuff. Uh, at least, you know, basic essentials. Are they still hurt, or are they okay? Or They're okay. Okay. I'm just concerned about the collar on their no neck right now. Yeah. Jackie said that she was going to try and she needs to get more information to figure out about that. Yes, Cassie, I'm inside the house. Boston's here too. Okay. Hmm. He worked well with photos of drawings. I drew hmm. uh, a simple, you know, doodles of how to change shirts. Mm. What? They don't even know? No. <laughs> Can they... S well, no. Clean this up. Go. Oh, I am coming. Oh, fuck. Go. Do you know what flowers are? They, uh, do you remember the grove that we went in? The green area? Uh, one of those plants. They're called plants. Did we discover that she can write? No, but she can read drawings. Ah, true. Here. True. That helps. You can take it out. Here, he's gonna plug it from his hand. Hold that up to you. You take it. You can you can smell it. You hold it up to your nose. You go. It smells real nice. Well, I'd like to elaborate to you, uh, Boston. That you, you can this take that. This individual is more animalistic than she is human. I don't think she understands any words that you're saying. Mm. Not only that, but I don't think she's ever seen a flower Boston in the first place. Mm. It's fine. <laughs> I try and do like the imitation of smelling it, but then I realize I don't have a nose. <laughs> <laughs> oh, pff, right. There's only two people in this room that have a nose. Maybe that won't work for them then. <laughs> yeah. However, you can put it up towards your antennae because that's where it has to be. No. What? I'll put it up your fucking antenna if you're not careful. <laughs> My antenna. All right, all right. Yeah, I see that. Would you like to smell it? What do we do with the body of the trine person? I basically ba uh, put it up to Cece's nose, technically, which is bees. So, the person that you shot up that was keeping them as a slave. I didn't shoot him. I don't know what the hell happened. Somebody with that. did. Okay. I think I know who, but. If that's the, if you don't know, I think the least the less amount of people who know, the better. Fair. Who found them? I think it was either Victor or Roland, one of the two. Okay. Well, I'll inform you guys as well that uh, in the road there was a bounty out for. Rogue Traverse Synthetic. I spent the whole morning trying to find it, just to find out that it was stabbing people. Uh, it got shot up, and returned back to Traverse, so... That's been my day. Mm. Well, look at you. Better than, you know... Half of the shit I've had to hear. Well, I know, you actually are helping someone, so... I'd like to hope so, but a union representative came down for the uh, for the elections, 
And they mm. said because of the bill, it's preferred that they have humans be put on the council. What? It's preferred, but they can't do much preferred? with it. It's preferred because of the bill. Yeah, that's stupid. What it's stupid, does this union have with the Undercity? Do they have any jurisdiction? Technically, we're on, we're on union ground. Well, the plan is. They spoke about Fritz, about how he was a con artist, and that his nominations, at least, he they mentioned that his nominations were me and Victor. So, yeah, definitely uh, not fun. I'm thinking. What? I mean, we could try and draw about the collar yeah. in the book. I don't think she knows anything about that. If we barely know anything yeah. about it. Okay, but I mean, we explain that at some point we want to try and take the collar off her. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, just draw a collar closed and a collar opened. I think you can and do it. Question mark. I think she'd understand. What, no, what, what you can do is draw like a drawing of her with the collar on, frowny face, mm -hmm. then picture of the collar off, happy face. Has she ever seen herself in a mirror? Why are you Can't asking you me? Can recognize that know. that's her? No, I mean, I drew her trying to, you know, because I was teaching her how to take off a shirt and, you know, change shirts. Huh? Don't you, you have a mirror in your house? Right there? We do. No, I don't see my fucking ugly mug, what the hell? <laughs> you're not ugly, you're pretty. <laughs> hey, can we save the flirting for another time? What flirting? <laughs> I'm just saying a fact. You're stupid. You're stupid. <laughs> Okay, on this side it's basically uh, with the, you know, it's your character again, but with the, the collar on, and then on the other side it's the same photo, but the collar is uh, clipped off sort of thing. Can you point to which one? Is the muzzle a part of the collar? Yes. If you remove it, she'll go ballistic. <sighs> Do you... Pictures. This? Or this? Do you want this? Off? Or on? I don't know why I'm trying to talk, because it's hard to... For me to explain from I mean, talking. For yourself, you know, I keep yourself on track. Yeah. Hmm. I'm I don't think she you. understands. I don't think she's ever yeah. seen the crash. Has, um, has she been given food since? Yes, she has. Mm -hmm. Okay. I've requested a bendy to make more. Maybe we should show her the mirror. I think I don't have a mirror. Do you mirror. have a mirror? Go oh, get the mirror the there. Do a side by side show her in the mirror and how she has that on, how you don't. Okay.
tried having her draw something? Like, have you given her the pen and paper? Or? Not yet, no. But before you Ugh. do that, hang on. Before you, before you show that. Stamp. Okay. The hello. Hi. Can I help you? Sorry. <laughs> oh, you could. No, they're not good. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I didn't do it, I swear. I didn't do it. Oh. <laughs> Having a moment. No. <laughs> so sorry. Hi, Glyn. Hmm. Yes. Having a moment. Uh, you get a text from Jackie. Come on. Hmm? What's it say? Uh, pretty simple one. It's mostly Jackie. This one will be replyable because he always left the map. Just, you know, hmm. just reply with a thumbs up or thumbs down. Um, Jackie has asked, hey, we currently are keeping somebody at the diamond who's on basically the run. They're fearing for their life due to the demi-human build. They might be in danger. Would mm. you mind setting up something a bit more permanent for them in the hotel? Okay. <sighs> All right. And you can't send a message to another team on the other map. See what we're gonna do. I mean, I, I could if it's really important. All right. Because Boston's gonna stay down here with them. Um, Boston's gonna give Jackie the code to the hotel. Take key number one. Room number one, because that's the safe room in Boston's hotel, and she can okay. set them up in there. All right, I'll go and give them a heads up. Thank you. Thank you. Uh -huh, that Did you put those changed. on? Did you put those on her? <laughs> no, I put them on her. Get them off. Do you really want to see the fish titties? Fish titties. What? Fish titties. What? <laughs> fish titties. <laughs> fish titties. <laughs> You know what that means? Fish orgy! Sorry. <laughs> oh my gosh. Got Jeez, them. I hear. <laughs> so it's basically gonna be um, a drawing of you looking at the mirror but seeing your reflection sort of thing. I hold it. I. 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 Beer. You wanna do it? Here you go. Basically a uh, mirror, maybe the size of an iPad. Ooh. Nope. Not a good idea. I don't think she has <laughs> the ability to recognize that that's her. <clears throat> yep. Again, how about, she's more okay, how about she's, this? How about this? What? You gently take her hand and guide to her face, and then she can realize that when she sees the image in the mirror touching their face, Maybe she can try and realize that that's her touching her face. It is wise. The brain can bridge the gap. Unless you want to hold the unless you want to hold the mirror. I'll hold and the then... mirror. Yeah, I think you should be the one to guide her hand. I don't like this little Cece. misty pool of weirdness. I don't know what you're doing here. Well, fuck you. Okay. It's where how I sleep. It's so I don't die in my sleep. Uh huh. Okay. Uh huh. I'm sure you don't do drugs in here either. I don't actually. Well. And yeah. That's you. Just don't like it. Hmm. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I don't think it's working. Okay. It was, a, it was an okay, idea. That's fine. I'll let go. There you go. You sat on the huh? fucking book. Get off the book. <laughs> oh, I'm fucking sorry. Fuck yourself. There you go. <laughs> Do you want to draw something in here? Whoa. I got the pen and the paper. This isn't the first time that I've had to teach somebody a language. You know, I've got a couple of books that would help with that. I mean, you can teach it tonight. I mean, I don't. I can't teach her the entirety of the English lexicon tonight, but I, I can maybe teach her like hot, cold. Are we cold, even aware blah, blah, blah. if she can hear us? 
Um, hold on. He's gonna clap and see if he if she reacts to any if she is. Okay, so that grabs her attention. She's not deaf. <laughs> she, if, she, if we, if she was deaf, she just doesn't understand. Would... Yeah. Okay. She doesn't understand common. Doesn't understand okay. her language. Okay. Basically, she's gonna put the pen in your hand. She's gonna hold it though to support the hand. And then just gonna help, like, try and move it, you know. To show like it, it's making like marks. Excuse me. Don't worry about that. Bless you. Excuse me. Hello, everybody. 30 minutes remaining in RP. Oh, shit. I gotta go. Has, it been, fucking noodles up. has it been 30 minutes? Holy shit. It's mm. been a long time. Wow. Does this make any sense? No, she don't help? understand. She just kind of holding on to it. Is, yeah, okay, so it's quote, it's like not. Yeah. Hmm, okay. I'll take the book and I'll just take the pen slowly out of your hand. I will slowly release your hand. Well, she seemed to like the flower. There you go. You want another flower? Blower. Oh, I will kick okay. my my foot is very dangerously close to you right now. Oh. <laughs> oh, there we go. Matches your hair. There we go, thank you. So just gotta sniff it. Well, that's something at least. It's good. I think she enjoys it. it smells sweet. Either way, we'll uh, do we need a, to get up to the noodle walk. shop. I do need to get up to the noodle shop. I will be back though when the row closes. I can just climb through the. Uh, right. I can stay here if you want. I mean, she seems to be liking the flowers, so. Okay. I mean, I'll be coming here because I, you know, I sleep here, so. Yeah. Me, We're sharing a bed. It don't seems. Mind me. Wait, wait, who is what? Who is sharing a bed? No. Not <laughs> oh, you. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That's, 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 that's where I'm at. <laughs> what do you mean? No, I don't. Shut up. Shut up. Yes, you do. Come on, scatter. No. What? It's... Okay. We'll let you rest. Okay. We'll let you sleep. You're gonna stay with her then? Yeah, I'll stay with her. Okay. He's gonna stay here. And be with you, okay? Hold on, I have an idea. I'll be back. I have an idea. Oh no. I'll be back, okay? I'll be back. If I take the shortcut up with you? Yeah. How do you know about, how do you know about the shortcut? How do you know about our secrets? She let me stay so in the back of the yeah. when I don't I don't like found out my girlfriend died. Well, she's a friend, Nancy. Shut up. Mm. Yes. Let's get over. Okay, so right now, first off, 
first things first. Baby sensory videos. He turns that on. And a reaction. Don't like. See that blueberry? Don't like? Okay. Alright. Um. Um. MMA. Basically, two guys in a cage fighting each other. Any response? She don't like that at all. Okay. Okay. Um, quiet music. A scenic view. Looks like it's uh, on a paradise planet. And it's a very, very calming song. It's like Lofi. And it's like a live stream into this uh, environment. How about it? Well, it looks like you enjoy that. <laughs> okay, he's going to pause that, save it. Okay, what else? He's going to show a video of sewing. Is it, does it show the needles? Yes, it's showing the needles. Basically, needle through fabric, oh, binding yeah, no. it together. You don't like that. Don't like? Okay, I've narrowed it down to needles. Alright, don't like needles. Don't like the fighting. There we go. What else? What else? What else? What else can I do for you? Um, it's going to show you a flock of birds. Flying from place to place. What you don't like? Toss. Okay. There we go. It's gonna show you angry birds. Don't like that. Fuck. Okay. Toss. <laughs> Motherfucker. Okay. Subway surfers. Huh? 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 Jump. Let him, let him go. He's running. She's confused. I'm just gonna take your finger. There we go. Take your hand. And basically, you'll start controlling the little gentleman jumping from place to place. And you're probably hit by a train right about now. You don't like that. Okay. It's off and away. Fuck. You don't like video games? No? Okay. <sighs> don't like birds, don't like all that. Um, what else can I do? He's just going to... Just, he's just gonna type in random images. <laughs> so there's many strange and random things, all of which are like Shutterstock images that all represents something random. He's gonna hold it in front of you and see. I'm gonna pick one. There's many things there. Perhaps the Red Cross. Perhaps the animals down there. Perhaps the video games that seems to scatter this place. Anything that you'd pick? She picks an image of a very dark room. some magical rune and the mushrooms as well as the lights above dim substantially oh yeah now it's fucking broken never mind okay let's see how it is so yes the mushrooms around they all dim a little bit including the bits above so now it's dim and you can barely see you can barely see anything however you can still walk around and all that jazz 
The only the only thing that's um, that is available is like the he's gonna make sure that the setting for brightness is all the way down on the tablet. He is going to file through all of the images once again, and there's a new set. Anything else? So basically, the thought process here is that she's communicating through images, mm -hmm. and well, she pointed towards the dark room. And she got to dark room because she pointed at it. So that's the thought process here. Picks a picture of the ocean. Mm. So there is three options. One of scuba diving on a very, very beautiful tropical planet. One is just very calming music while listening to the sounds of the waves. And the other one is just watching an ecosystem based around a lagoon. Uh, and like you can see animals here and there and blah, blah, blah. And he basically puts all three up and in you know, a palatable and basically which one would you prefer? So picks the third one. So basically watching a lagoon with the waves trudging in and out, trudging in and out with the animals going from place to place. No music. Mm -hmm. So he's going to make sure that there's good charge on his tablet, and he's just going to hand it off to you. I know it's becoming an iPad kid. I know! It's the only way that I can communicate with her! <laughs> uh. See? It's good, no? And look, look at this, look at this. He's gonna hit the little bar at the, at the bottom and he's gonna go back in the uh, live stream. And he's gonna go back forward in the live stream. See? So you can pick whatever you want to be watching. Take it, he takes your hand very gently and places it against, places the finger right up against the bar. See? I'm just saying, see, see, it's very distracted right now, so now would be a good time to have a look at the color if you wish so. The color? Mm hmm. Oh, yes, so true. And he does exactly that. He's very careful not to poke it or anything like that, but he's making sure that, like, it is actually technician shit. Well, if you go all the way to the back, so you'll see a name tag. Oh! Whoa! He kind of just, like, no, I'm not, I'm not. I'm not exclaiming at anything like that. I'm not being stupid. I'm watching with you. This is interesting. You see that weird looking dog thing? You see that shit's going across the beach. Wow, that's insane. Oops, he didn't turn. He's going to very, very, very gingerly move the hair. Oh. The name tag says Princess. Princess. I don't know if I can call you that. Oh, that's a, I think it's a gross name given by your owners. Oh no. Ah, uh, hmm. Princess? Oh shit! You respond to that? Huh. Hmm. Well, fucking hell. All right, don't don't worry about that. Don't worry. Look, 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 look. Look at the look at the dog. There's a dog down there. So interesting. At ease? Ah, uh, princess. Uh, princess down. No shit. Oh shit. Okay. Um. Don't look at me like that. 
Shit, what do we do? Uh... Per Assuming how they treated you, and it's been animalistic, I'm going to see if I can access anything that's animalistic. Okay. Okay. Princess, um... Speak? No? Okay. Princess... Uh... I've never done this before. So I have your attention. I assume that you're waiting for a command. But what would the command be? Well, so in her scenario, normally her name would only be called mm. when she's being called out to the fight pit. So essentially, she's technically waiting to get the muscle off. So she can go into fight mode. Uh, I don't know if that's a good idea. However, it's very much not. He's going to place his thumb against the muzzle. Hmm. <laughs> and he's just going to keep it there. Don't worry. Then he pushes the iPad, iPad up. Not the iPad, the tablet. Legally distinct. Holy hell, okay. He's going to do some extra inspection just to make sure that the uh, cuts on her body are healing properly, if there's any other trauma, any scars, any clues into anything else. Uh, most scars and such would have been healed because of her... She's low mm. keeping. The, de the super, like, fierce and, like, gnarly ones can show, like the ones that you saw on CC. Yeah. But if you haven't faced a such a gnarly uh, strike, then that's probably just fortuitous. And you stay right there. Stay right there. Okay. Come here. She's looking okay, at food. Take your hand. She's looking at food. Oh, did... Wait, did she switch by herself? Yeah. <gasps> oh! Oh! Are you hungry? What is she looking at? What specifically? Uh, basically just a cooking tutorial. Like, it was the very end of a cooking tutorial where they, like, pull out a turkey from the oven. Oh. Hold on, let me go check the fridge. Uh, oh, the fuck? What was that? Okay, anyway. Right. I think I definitely have meat, but it's probably gonna be sand flea. So we, this is some smoked sand flea leftovers um, that I had a little while ago. It's cold. It's just straight out of the fridge. However, the aroma is actually quite pleasant. It's something that you could easily smell, especially with a tenant like yours. And he's going to open the box and he's going to show it. It's really, it smells really, really good, but it doesn't look that, got, look that nice. And he's just looking for a response, any kind of reaction. He doesn't seem interested. Fuck. Damn it. He's gonna pick it up and toss it. Ugh, food like that is expensive. Hmm. She's 
changing it to another cooking tutorial where they're tenderizing a piece of meat, like a steak. Meat. Shit. I might have to hit up a friend of mine. But that's for tomorrow. Is there anything else that you want to show me? Anything at all? No? No? Kind of just skipping through like different food tutorials, some ocean views, some waters. Occasionally some very dark rooms as well. Just kind of just scrolling through. He's gonna hold up a big old black hoodie. Hmm? He's gonna take your, her hand off the tablet real fast. He's not gonna take the tablet away, but he's gonna place the hand amongst the hoodie, amongst the fabric. And basically, it's, it's comfy. It's warm. It's nice. It's pleasant. But it's also big. It's Cassie sized. So it wouldn't fit you in any way, shape, or form, but it's a baggy ass hoodie. So he's going to grab the uh, sleeve. He's going to put it, he's going to scrunch it down real quick. And he's going to easily just throw it over her hand so it's all the way through on the other half, on the other side. He's going to put this tablet in her hand. And he's going to do the same process over here with the other hand. There we go. He's going to push it towards you and towards your chest. There we go. And he's going to hold open the... Uh, Hello, everybody. Oh. Five minutes until our ends. He's going to hold open the hole where your head goes. And he's going to very gingerly place it above. Like, he's going to stretch it up above her head, down, and make sure that her ears are one, each one. Each one is through, so it's not irritating. He's going to put it on her. And he's going to put it down towards her back. So it's just a warm hoodie. It's just, it's just, a, it's just comfy. Just to cover her up. What? What, is there something on my face? Do I look stupid? I look at the tablet. What else do you want to show me? You're, you've got the dark room. Tomorrow I'll work on getting you the, that meal. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. He takes just for a second. He takes control, takes your hand off, puts it on the side. He types in, and it cycles, and there's a, uh, this basically a sky dimming to sunset tonight to morning. And he then forwards real fast to that cooking meal to the tenderizing of the steak. Seem reasonable? You don't really understand the concept of day and night. Fuck. Oh. I'm on comms. <laughs> I could care less. Okay. Anyway. Bird. Anyway. So he's going to take the... Uh, basically dark room. Dark room. And play a video of the lights. Oh, no. 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 Ah. Oh. I still, Man. I still have the tavern shit around my fucking peripherals. Oh. I was sort of replied that it's upset. I was so proud to have one of the dog. It wasn't even violent. Oh. Oh. Hello. You are now an iPad kid. Congratulations. You be. Hi, hello, everybody. I hope you guys had fun. I'm an iPad kid now. You did a good job for kind of our first time doing wow. normal construction. You be. I've seen, I've seen this creature around three different times. Every time, I got pulled away. <laughs> Yeah, it was an honor. She had a good time. Yeah. Oh, I full body effect anyway, so that was unfortunate. Yeah. 
Stop it, you fucking idiot. <laughs> I recorded it, I have evidence, I recorded it.